It is the front page of every paper. Obviously, we've talked about it a lot this morning about uh, Kate, uh, the Princess of Wales, and her diagnosis. Um, what's the response been from your side? It has been absolutely huge. I mean, when this came out, it's uh, obviously been a massive shock to a lot of people. Um, but the Princess of Wales has actually received a huge outpouring of support from famous faces after she revealed that she is undergoing this treatment. Um, so just to read a few, we've had Hollywood star Catherine Zeta-Jones. She said, Wales and the world is with you. Love to you always. We've had Gary Lineker, who wrote awful news, wishing the Princess of Wales a full recovery. Underneath the Instagram post, there have been absolutely so many comments. Gabby Roslin reacted, sharing love hearts. Uh, TV presenter Dan Walker said it's such a tough time for the royal family. And he said that hopefully they'll have the best possible care. Um, we've also had celebrities like Martin Kemp and his family. They've shared photos where they've met the Princess of Wales and they've all said they really, really hope that she makes a quick and speedy recovery. So there's been a huge outpouring around the world from famous faces. Good. I just hope they throw their weight behind people getting cancer diagnosis and fundraising for uh, cancer equipment. Yeah, well, we, you know, we've also seen so celebrities who are undergoing their own cancer treatment and, and have spoken about their cancer battles recently. So we've got actress Olivia Munn, for example. So she came out not too long ago and said that she was going through her own secret cancer battle. Um, so she's also said, thank you for showing what it's like to fight with grace and determination for yourself and for your family. And also, of course, Strictly Come Dancing's Amy Dowden. She's been very open and honest about her own cancer battle, and she has also said said that it kind of hit her hard when she heard the Princess of Wales's news. But again, she said that she really, really hopes that the Princess of Wales gets better as soon as possible. And she said that she was actually lucky enough to meet her when she was going through her own um, cancer treatment. It's really interesting, actually, uh, how it takes people back. And in fact, one of our producers yesterday I was talking to, Gabriella, she was she was really tearful about um, about the news. And I think that kind of takes you back to uh, and I think for her and I, I, I don't think she'll mind me saying but it, you know obviously something that happened in her family for example I think it takes you back to that place where you do learn of a diagnosis and the fear and trepidation absolutely totally and I think that's why at the moment, it's it's a real call for a lot of celebrities and people who have said things and speculated. It's A lot of people have said, this is your time now to take ownership. Now, I know you've already touched um, a couple of times on Blake Lively, so we won't... Yeah. Well, well just, just tell us more, because I didn't know who she was, if I'm being quite honest. So, Blake, actress, Gossip Girl, is probably most, her most famous role, but also the wife of Ryan Reynolds, um, a brilliant actress, but... Obviously, what happened with that was she put up an Instagram post. Um, she would join that kind of speculation, as a lot of people did. And she kind of edited her photo and said, I've been missing in action. And, and it was a real joke at, you know, the Mother's Day post. So now Blake has obviously had to come out. Um, she has done. And actually, she's been praised for apologising. A lot of people have said that other celebrities need to follow in her shoes. She said, now you know why I've been MIA. Uh, that's what she said on the Instagram post. But she said, I'm sure no one cares but I feel like I have to acknowledge this. She said she made a silly post around the Photoshop fails frenzy. Um, she says she's now mortified and she has apologised for that. But because of this, it's actually led to a lot of people saying, where are all the other apologies? I mean, Kim Kardashian's one of the biggest ones. She put up a picture of herself not too long ago. The caption read something like, on my way to find Kate. Now that has received a huge amount of backlash. And I just checked and the post is still there. The caption hasn't been edited. Um, so she's not come out and said anything to do with that. And people are saying, you need to apologize. It's a serious matter.